Explosion. Gia Miller goes around the ring with the angel of the ring, Zaya Brookside. The Don West, you've got to be kidding me, top five trending topics of the week. In case you missed it, and our main event, we'll see singles action as Hammerstone squares off with Cody Deer. But first, it's from the vault. TNA Explosion starts now. Our main event, Ace and Bay challenging the Motor City Machine Guns for the Impact World Tag Team titles. What an opportunity, an opportunity long awaited for for Ace and Bay, who very much are like the next generation of the Motor City Machine Guns. This could be a historic, historic night. Big Thursday night of action here for Impact. We want to remind you every Wednesday night, check out the new hit series, The Power Hour. Tune in for the hottest music videos and latest news in the world of rock, featuring exclusive interviews with Dave Mustaine, Alice Cooper, and so much more. Wednesdays at 10 Eastern, right here on Access TV. Right now, the early goings so of this one, a little bit of a little sign of respect, maybe, from, oh, but throw it up. Oh, oh, hey, come on now. I don't know how much respect there is between Saban and Austin after their rivalry in 2021. You saw the shirt as uh, Austin was making his entrance. And earlier on tonight, I beat Chris Saban. Also pinned Saban at no surrender. Yeah, but what's better than a handshake? A two sweet. I know because you've never gotten one. You've never felt the ecstasy from getting a two sweet from a member of the Bullet Club. But oh, it's glorious. So Ace Austin refocusing here on Chris Saban. Saban, of course, the former Impact World Champion, but he and Alex Shelley have set the standard for tag team wrestling, not only here in Impact Wrestling, but over the last two decades, really defining what tag team wrestling is all about and changing many of the careers of wrestlers all over the world. I, I agree with one little caveat. They set the former standard. Standards change, they evolve. Wrestling Tag changes game. and evolves, and Ace and Bay are at the forefront of that evolution. And Austin was not aware of the tag there. Shelly, very shrewd, waiting for the moment there to grab Austin. Oh! oh! Got him from behind there. Now a two-on-one opportunity for the guns, which they love. I mean, hey, there is no doubt in my mind that everything Ace and Bay said about the machine guns is true. They just they are so fantastic. And in many ways, they, they've aged like a fine 1947 Tag. Cheval Blanc. They are just getting better all the time. But still, I believe this is Ace and Bay's time. And in comes Chris Bay, a Las Vegas resident. He moved out here seven years ago from his home in Virginia. He came out here because he wanted to learn how to become a professional wrestler, wanted to enroll in a school. He left his friends and family behind to do so. When he moved out here, he, he didn't have anywhere to go. As a matter of fact, and it sounds odd, he slept on a friend's kitchen floor next to the oven for the first seven months that he lived out here in Las Vegas. He was, at the time, working at a local mall, pursuing wrestling throughout. And he was, in fact, setting up rings, as he mentioned earlier on tonight, right here at Samstown Casino for a number of wrestling events, including Impact. And what a story to potentially see that all that hard work paid off here in glorious fashion right here in front of his adopted hometown of Las Vegas. It would just be picture perfect, but tell Shelly and Saban are not gonna let that one go without a fight. A tag made, Saban is legal. The guns are trying to get as many of these tags as they can without Ace and Bay noticing Saban with a big clothesline. And, and I gotta notice something a little bit. We all know Motor City Machine Guns for their, their high speed offense, their well-coordinated tag team maneuvers, but oh. there's a little extra stank on, on the strikes, a little extra attitude from the Cover, guns. Look to the leg to hold on to the titles, kick out by Bay. Everything they're doing, that like they're, they have a little bit of something in their craw when it comes to Bullet Club, something to prove to these two young guys. Uh, look at Shelly just bouncing around. The guns are having some fun here. Granted, they're out to prove a point. They've been downright nasty here since the bell. And a tag made. You could see the veteran move there by the guns, waiting so that the official saw the tag was made. Shelly legal. There's 
the athleticism of oh! the ultimate finesse causing an early miscue. Not too often you see that from the guns early in a match. Oh, well, well, we saw it at No Surrender, which was a big surprise, seeing it again so soon. I don't know, maybe maybe there's a little weakness in the armor of the Motor City Machine Guns. Double drop kicks Ace and Bay through the ropes, take down Saban and Shelly. Their very first match as a tag team came against the Guns this past summer, and it has come down to this, a tag team title shot here in Vegas. And Ace and Bay, who have taken the charge for Bullet oh. Club, here in Impact Wrestling, a Bullet Club which is currently leaderless after the exile Jay White was removed from New Japan Pro Wrestling. So these guys have got to carry the flag here in Impact. Hold on to win the tag team title. Shelly gets the shoulder up in time. And even before that happened to Jay White, he kind of left the boys here. They represented the Bullet Club on their own here. That is a lot of responsibility to carry that torch, to carry that flag for the BC. But Whoa. these guys have carried it with great pride and great, great effect. Oh, look out here. Armbar here and using the Ooh. playing card. The official didn't see it. Austin at his back to the referee and slides the card up his sleeve and uh, there's no Saints in this match. On a shot there at Saban, uh, my case in point. The literal ace up the sleeve of Ace Austin. A tag made, back in comes Chris Bay. And how this one has changed the teamwork, coming oh. in great effect for Ace and Bay here. Now Bay focuses in on Alex Shelley, whips him across the ring. Got a lot of Bullet Club Ooh. faithful here in Las Vegas, backing him up. Winding up on that one, making it count to oh. <laughs> Uppercut right to the spine there of Alex Shelley. A, B, C, it's easy as one, two, sweet, baby. Bullet Club in firm control of the guns. Oh, back elbow there by Shelley. Shelley going to the second rope here. Oh, oh and a knee to the left arm of Chris Bay and a shot there. At Ace Austin by Shelly. This left arm has been focused on for a number of weeks now by Kushida. Oh, and now Saban coming in here. Getting oh. a little double team action in behind the official's back. And the official's trying to control Ace Austin, who's ticked off after Shelly went after him. Oh, and now a two on one attack by the guns. A little bit of veteran gamesmanship there from the guns. Kudos, credit where credit is due, and it is effective. And I mentioned how over the last few weeks, Kushida has attacked the arm of Chris Bay, not only in a tag team match, but in a great singles match between Bay and Ooh. Kushida, and then how apropos that they battled at no surrender. So no doubtedly, the other third of Time Machine giving a little bit of information oh. to the guns. Now taking a cheap shot there at Ace Austin. And the targeted attack on the arm of Chris Bay. That's Tossing gonna make Bay. Art of Finesse pretty hard and one, two, sweet, pretty difficult as well. Oh, Bay sent into the barricade. Now Shelly turning his attention to Ace Austin. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh God! And ripping Austin off of the apron. Shelly takes a bow, and really, the boys from Detroit are rolling at this point in the match. Had the absolute control over Ace and Bay. There's no doubt. In the machine guns got this one going. Going after the damaged left arm here of Chris Bay as the official is focusing on the opposite side of the ring. Alex Shelley is the legal member of the Motor City Machine Guns at this point. Oh. And look at Shelley toying with Bay after he took away the tag option of Austin. Shelley is having almost too much fun here. Oh, here goes the roll up here. down to hold on to the titles and a kick out by Bay. Oh, and now look at this. Floating right into that cross face. Border City stretch, and now look at this. Bay trying to get to the bottom rope, and he does. And again, remember the damage done to the left arm. And Saban here capitalizing on that very fact. Oh, oh smashes the right arm. Oh, big kick by Saban. Ace and Bay are in a bad way right now. The Impact World Tag Team titles are on the line here in Vegas. Right now, Ace 
got Chris Saban up in a very dangerous position here. I see in the back of your screen there, Bay knocking Shelly off the apron as well. Critical opportunity for Ace and Bay. The guns love two on one shots. Well, Ace and Bay taking that page right out of their playbook. If it's good enough for you guys, it's good enough for us. Saban now fighting two on one. Saban, cross body, wipes out Ace and Bay. But no partner for Saban to tag. You saw him look over to his corner there. Oh, look at this, a little two for one action for Saban. Saban managing to hold his own, at least for the moment. Chris Bay eliminated from the equation for now. Look, look at the look on Saban's face. Saban and Shelly teaming up against Ace Austin. Look Whoa. at Chris Bay protecting Austin wait, from Scotty Bones. Backslide. Oh, nearly a duplicate of what happened in No Surrender. Almost taking one of the biggest pieces of ammunition out of the gun's playbook there. Tag made. Chris Bay is legal into the matchup. Saban tied up with Ace and Bay. Hold up, hold up here. Now look at Shelly going after Ace Austin. Uh-oh. Oh, oh wait, wait. Great counter there from Saban. Saban's got the damage left on. Oh, Ooh. and a dragon screw to the left leg of Austin by Shelly. Dragon screw while also tied up in the ropes for a little exclamation point. And now it's back to two on one. Oh, oh right to the arm of Chris Bay. And a tag made. Shelly is legal. Austin has been taken off the apron by Shelly. Is this the end for Ace and Bay? Oh, could be looking for Cradle Shock here. He's Not today. He's trying to set up for Cradle Shock again. Shelly is legal. Uh oh, cutter! Oh! A desperate cutter by Bay. Managed to pop it off there despite the pick. Oh! another one on Shelly. But Ace Austin, nowhere to be found. And now Chris Bay looking to his corner. Ace Austin rolling into the ring. Damage has been done to Austin's left knee, remember. Oh, they're calling for it though. Could we see it, the one, two, sweet? No, wait. Oh, let's go for the first part, the art of finesse. Saban ripping Austin out of the Ooh. ring. And Shelly drives Bay into the turnbuckles. And he drives him in shoulder first, Tom. Continuing to laser target that left arm of Bay. Now Saban going up top. Saban, drop Ooh. kick. Doomsday device off the top. Inside out and toppling all the way to the mat. Dangerous, dangerous position for Chris Bay here. And now Shelly with shell shock. Is this it for Ace and Bay? No. Oh no, wait a minute. A transition there off the kick out by Bay. Immediately into the Border City stretch. Dead center of the ring. And imagine all the pain already, all the damage already done to the arm of Chris Bay, now being ripped, stretched in half. Bay doing everything possible to stay alive, got out of shell shot, gets to the wait, bottom wait, wait, oh. oh, and a kick to the right arm. And now look at Shelly roll this over into another Border City stretch. We always see how nasty Alex Shelley is, but Saban is bringing it himself. This is a different side of the guns here tonight. Oh, now Austin went to save Chris Bay, but look at Saban oh, setting him up. up. Cradle Ooh. shock! And Shelly continues the assault. Shelly and Bay, the two legal men. Wait, hold up here, Tom. Hold cover, up. cover by Bay. Oh, nearly had Shelly. And look at the eyes of Shelly. He can't believe he's making sure it was two. He thought that was almost it. Chris Bay was held up in the Border City stretch for a long time. Somehow found a way out and nearly captured the titles. The resilience oh. of Chris Bay. He's got to dig down deep. He's had to dig down deep all match long. And is it becoming too much? The two on one. Oh, now it's oh. Austin coming in to back up Bay. Superman forearm. Somehow oh. continuing to fight. Continuing oh. championship gold in their eyes. Chris Saban out of the ring. And there's the one. The out of finesse. And two. The fold. Is it Sweet Bay? It's legal. It's time for Racing Bay in Vegas. <laughs> Here are your winners. And new Impact World Tag Team Champions. Asos.
Houston and Chris Bay Bullet Club. Bullet Club guns down Saban and Shelly for the Impact World Tag Team titles. Write it down in permanent ink. ABC stands for always be champs. And now on TNA Explosion, it's time for the Don West, you've got to be kidding me, top five trending topics of the week in honor of the late, great TNA Hall of Famer, Don West. At number five, you can join us this weekend in Spartanburg, South Carolina for two nights of TNA Impact, our final editions of Impact on our way towards Bound for Glory. And part of that, this Saturday, September 28th, Steph DeLander has selected TNA World Champion Nick Nemeth to face Matt Cardona in a Pick Your Poison match. You can get your tickets now for TNA in Spartanburg at TNAWrestling.com. At number four, last week on Impact, we saw a Texas death match for the ages in San Antonio. Mike Santana leaping off of a ladder and crushing JDC through our tech tables inside Boeing Center at Techport. Ultimately, Mike Santana would get the win against JDC of the system, but a sneak attack by Moose after the fact left the face of the franchise standing tall over Santana. At number three, it was recently on NXT that Wes Lee revealed unseen footage of him attacking Trey Miguel in a parking lot in Dayton, Ohio, the home state of the Rascals. Zachary Wentz went on NXT and fired back at Wes Lee for his actions. Those two collide in a street fight in Chicago on October 1st on NXT. At number two, last week on Impact, we saw the Hardys team up with Masha Slamovich up against Tasha Steeles and the TNA World Tag Team Champions, The System. Once again, the Hardys scored a pinfall victory against Eddie Edwards and Brian Myers, but what a collaboration we saw between Slamovich and the Hardys. Masha, who revealed earlier on in the night how the Hardys inspired her when she was young. And at number one, last week on Impact, Santina Morella declared the number one contenders match between Joe Hendry and Frankie Kazarian that we saw go down last night on Impact. Joe Hendry came out the winner, and it is official. On Saturday, October 26th, live on pay-per-view and TNA Plus in Detroit, Joe Hendry will challenge Nick Nemec for the TNA World Championship at Bound for Glory. Still to come with Jake something in his corner, it's Hammerstone Wall One with Cody Diener. But up next, it's Around the Ring with Gia Miller, starring Zaya Brookside. That's next on Explosion. Welcome back to TNA Explosion, and now it's time for Around the Ring with Gia Miller. What's up, everybody? It's Around the Ring. It's Main Jam Miller, and it's my, sorry, Ace Austin, love of my life, Zaya Brookside. Best friends yes. and soul sisters. Yes. Episode two. Episode two. Yes. It's been a while since I, since I had you on this show. Mm -hmm. And it was like, that. I really feel like that was right after we had, like, really first, I mean, we connected immediately. Yeah. But it was like, it was like the birth of our friendship. And now here we are. Months down the road. And there's so much more chemistry. Oh my God. And we are becoming the same person. As if we weren't already. She said hello to the taxi driver today. And I was like, you sounded just like me. And she gets in and she's like, hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> we uh, noticed that we tend to swap accents a lot. Yeah. Uh, because I just by default, like, will start speaking in a British accent. Like, one of my favorite things, anytime someone asks me something, I go, all right. Or what? 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 <laughs> what? That, but she thinks I'm making fun of her, so she'll ask me a question. I didn't what? even know I what? said it like that until she pulled me up for it. Yeah, what? 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 Uh, but. And I go, ha! Ha! <laughs> yeah, let me, let me hear it. Let them hear it. Ha! Where are we today? We're in San Antonio, Texas. Oh, are you so excited to be here? I am so excited to be here. Oh, yeah. We, she's in her element right now, because, I mean, if I you I went straight off the plane, into my cowboy boots, and straight to this And menu. what did you wear on the plane? I wore my cowboy hat the whole way. She did? And there was like real actual cowboys and then there's just me, little British me. Mm -hmm. And I was getting videos of her uh, in the airport. Running uh, through the airport because Atlanta airport is not very nice to us ever. No, no, it's terrible. It's almost as bad as the Charlotte airport. Yes. 
Uh, but I mean, we we planned our outfits on Facetime yeah. this week. Mm -hmm. uh, this also, I feel like, is a good redemption for us this week because uh, if you don't know, we both stream on Twitch. Um, kind of. Uh, Gia streams <laughs> on Twitch, oh, and I try, but I'm like a granny in a 25 year old body, and I can't seem to figure out anything technology wise. Uh, well, we're, and you know what? We're in it together. Uh, we yes. tried to stream together, like with that thing on Twitch. It was a technological nightmare. It was. Now people are making fun of me. Yeah. Uh, and you know what? It'll be okay. It'll be fine. We'll uh, we'll get through it. So I'm not like taking is... it down. No, no, no. Because one day in six months' time, we're gonna be like, look how far. Look she how came. far we've come. Yes. yes. So I feel like this is a good redemption. We're actually able to have a conversation without there being three seconds in between. Well, each because other's we have a great team. Yes, we do have a. We look, can't take the credit. Round of applause. We just round sat applause. here <laughs> for our team. So wonderful. Yeah, all we had to do was sit here and uh, everybody else does the does yeah. the real work. We just yap. We're professional yappers. Mm -hmm. uh, so, okay, Zaya, what's going on, girl? Uh, tell me about this outfit. Uh, we're already almost out of time, but tell me about your outfit today. Because... We have to get the boots, so I don't know what we can see here. here. Hold on, I can stick my foot up. Here's mine. It's oh, yeah. It's a skirt, There we so go. It's good. Yeah, it's a... <laughs> That's why we wear skorts we around wear here. We wear skorts, but we have matching boots on. Yep. Um, we're in San Antonio. We had a great show. Oh, yeah. Victory great pay-per-view, Victory Road. And what is that, one of our biggest shows so far? Yeah, I mean, well, each time it's been it's bigger. It's getting bigger and, and bigger, bigger and bigger, and bigger <laughs> honestly. You guys are welcome. We are on the road to Bound for Glory, and I'm super excited for that. Yeah. It's, it's, it's just and you know what good. The you know what the color of Bound for Glory is? Oh, it's blue, baby. It's uh, Brookside blue, baby. It's blue, and we're going. Oh, we are yeah. going in strong for Bound for Glory. And you know where else we're going? To the Cowboys Dance Hall. We are! We're going, we to, are we're going, to, go. going to learn how to dance. We're going to ride a bull together. <laughs> we're going honky tonkin. Uh, it's going to be incredible. It I'm is. sure there will be lots of pictures and videos. We have to get videos. Okay. It's a memory. I have to go put on my denim dress now so that we can match because I, I had already had this outfit on. But so. And i got to go get my country gear on. Yes. Okay, so we will reconvene. Zaya, thank you for sitting down. Thank you. Can't wait for episode five, six, seven, eight. All, all of them. I'll have you eight million more times. Guys, this has been Around the Ring. Up next, did you miss anything from Impact? No problem. We're going to get you all caught up. It's in case you missed it. Next on Explosion. Welcome back to TNA Explosion. And now it's time for In Case You Missed It. You can tell what this means to them when that clothesline from Kaz just a little bit more bounce in it than it normally would. A little more striking powder because he knows that he's got a chance. And here come the Puss in Boots chance. Oh, hold on a second now. Thinking uh -oh. about fade to black. This could end the night for Hendry and dash his dreams. Look out, look out. Well, stack. Back to the ankle. Ankle lock again by Hendry. Has anyone ever inadvertently passed the torch to somebody with their own move before? This is now his adopted instantly, he's and he's crushing it. He's a thief. He is a thief. a thief. Wrestling court after this, but he might tap him out right here. Is Kazarian going to submit to Joe Henry? Just a little bit more pressure to have that ankle twist just a little bit more, and he won't be able to take it, but he's got it almost oh, at a 90-degree oh, angle. Is Kaz going to tap? Is Kaz going to tap? Oh. No, Kazarian gets to the bottom oh, row. Oh, thank God. Here's a bit of the amateur part where it doesn't come into play for Henry. You could have held it for a four count while still following the rules, done a little bit more damage to that ankle, and he's got to hobble around the rest of the way. That could be what cost him. A veteran like Kaz would have held it to four and a half. Nick, I have Absolutely. to ask you, are you in any way worried about the momentum that Henry has built this year if you do have to face him at Bound for Glory? Absolutely not. I love it. I'm rooting for him. I feel that. I get shivers up and down my arms when his entrance comes out, but I am oh! not. Oh, no! Wait a minute! Slingshot DDT. Could it be Kaz and Nemeth at Bound for Glory in a kick out? It, uh, I'll ask something on the flip side, then. Are you worried about seeing everything Kaz has done in his matches to get to that world title? And Are you worried about that? I know that's that right. he's willing to do just about anything, and that's what scares me a little bit more than a loud crowd getting behind somebody and feeding off of them. So either way, they both have their positives and negatives, but right now, here's where it comes down to. Who wants it more in the final minutes? The last Whoa. couple pieces out to the floor. And Kazarian sent hard to the outside by Joe Hendry in this number one contenders match. How's the strength of Hendry there coming into play? We know the power game that Hendry brings to the table. 
He doesn't act like it, but he's got some strength in there, and you can see it in those moves, launching somebody out to the floor. Oh, he's gonna act oh, like it right here we go. Oh, pound for pound, the strongest man in TNA. Boom! Oh, and the suplex to Kazarian on the outside. You can tell what he's willing to do for this, to suplex someone on the floor. It hurts you almost as much as the other guy, but he knows it'll take just a little bit more out of Kaz. Smart move by the kid. Hendry rolls back inside. And Hendry. Maybe he's reaching for another pair of sunglasses. Oh, He's checking. On. Wait a minute! What's... Ref! He's got a set of press marks! Easy, what Snitch! Here? What are you doing? Hey, to be fair, it's only cheating if you get caught. I just... Let him hand, let him handle his day! To yeah. us! Business. Let him handle his business. There's no instant replay. In... Oh! oh! Kazarian cracked Henry with the breast. That you got come on. The ref didn't see Don't it. end a contender Cover. like... Oh, yeah. you got to be kidding me. Kazarian's going to bow for glory. Here's your winner. And then Guys. I, I, I want the rightful Freddy fighter to be fighting me no matter what. Hey. Hang on a second, hang on. Wait, what is he, what is he doing? Did he just say it's only if you... Oh, come on! What is this? Nick Nemeth is showing the brass knuckles to the referee. Ref, he's absolutely right! He literally just said it's only if you get caught! You have to do the right thing here. Nick Nemeth wants to face the rightful winner of this match. What, never met our gang and up on him? And our referee There's another referee of all here? coming down here to reinforce He's the decision. Sick. You cheated, Kaz! No, no, oh, come on now. Now the director of authority is here. Santino Morella is on the case. Hey, Kazarian, you see these white balls in my skull? Those are my eyes. And they just saw what you just did, okay? And because this match has implications for Bound for Glory, not to mention the complete disrespect and disregard for the rules, I'm sick to my stomach. I'm ordering this match by the power invested in me to restart right now. Oh, come on. Yes. It was over. That's the right call. It was over. Come on, Frankie! Are Finish you what you me? started! I can't believe this! Look out! And now Hendry! Can no. he surprise Kazarian? Shoulders no. down and a kick out! Come on. Every pinfall here could be the last. Off of the ropes, Kazarian with a big clothesline. Back in control. Now, hey, win the match in the ring. Let's fight and bow for glory for the title if you earn it. Earn it right now. But Nick, you were absolutely right. Earn your fight. That shot. With the brass knuckles, did it just spell the beginning of the end for Joe Hendry? It, 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 by the way, he just might just be prolonging the inevitable here. It looks like he can barely get to his feet. He needs some kind of strike, one last little shot. Oh. Oh, this might be it. This might be a slow, brutalizing end. But you know what? Following the rules after breaking them, I mean, the I, right thing I, has been is done. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna finish what he started. He's gonna end this with an exclamation point. He's really gonna make might. sure all these so-called believers see it go down clear as day. Chance of let's go, Joe here in, in his San Antonio. Sights. Off of the ropes. Oh, what? he caught him. He caught him. Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. Come on. Cover. 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 He got Cover. him. He is bound. Whoa. believe how this all went down. Frankie Kazarian had it on lock. Joe Hendry has knocked down obstacle after obstacle this year. His one goal the entire time has been to capture the TNA World Championship. Joe Hendry has earned his place in Detroit, Michigan. It'll be Nick Nemeth and Joe Hendry for the TNA World Championship at Bow.
crown for glory. Up next, it's our main event. Hammerstone squares off with Cody Deaner. This match is next on Explosion. Welcome back to TNA Explosion, and now it's time for our main event. The following contest is set for one ball. Introducing first, being accompanied by Jake Something, Hammerstone. And we're ready for competition here on TNA Explosion in San Antonio, Texas. Hammerstone and Jake something. The last time we saw these two was on the countdown to Victory Road. They got a victory against Steve Macklin and Eric Young. And Gio, we're being joined here on commentary by Jake something. Jake, this is a first for you. I have to ask. How are things going thus far between yourself and Hammerstone? What we saw at the Countdown to Victory Road, it looks like you two can be dominant as a team. Looks like it. We beat two former world champions. It ain't looking like it, it is. Understandable, tonight Hammerstone is set to go one-on-one -on -one with your own cousin, Diener. Okay, all right. The people have spoken. Dinner, of course, believes in the people's choice. Earlier on this year, he decided to turn over a new leaf, thought he'd been doing things the wrong way, making his own decisions. So now he's going to the fans, and uh, what's he doing, Gia? Um, it, it seems like he might be taking a survey. Uh, maybe, a, maybe a poll? Uh, suggestions, perhaps? Wait. What is he writing down? I, 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 can't, I can't quite make it out. Oh, he's taking move suggestions from the crowd, it seems. DDT. Bar, bar, stunner, stunner. Two stunners. Okay. Two stunners? Well, we are in Texas. Jake, I think, can you shed any light on this? He is your cousin. No, I can't, actually. This is ridiculous. But nonetheless, uh, this is Cody Diener one-on-one -on -one with Hammerstone. And it was last week on Impact, Jake, that himself and Hammerstone and appear were in the middle of a workout, and Hammerstone decided that he wanted to work out in the ring and wanted to go one-on-one -on -one with your, your cousin. You seemed as eager about it as Hammerstone was. What, what's going on here? I mean, he interrupted us. We were clearly doing something, right? So he was being rude. Okay. And it warranted this? He's had that coming for a long time. I, got him. I understand you two have been hot and cold tag team partners yeah. off and on this yeah. year, but I, mean, oh, I want to go back to when you first returned to this company last summer. Do you remember its anniversary? Yeah, I mean, you were a surprise at Ultimate X. I mean, it was a pleasant surprise. I think everyone was excited to see you come back and, and to see what you could accomplish. Uh, now, unfortunately, it, you weren't successful in that return, but, but I mean, the world was ahead of you. Diener's trying to get some uh, input here from the fans in San Antonio for what move to do next. Just going for a stunner, Jake. Uh, makes sense. Uh, now Diener up onto the apron here. I, he seems very gung-ho about this, Jake, that he's going to dive in there and hit a, a stunner on the 265-pounder Hammerstone. 265 pounds. He's not going to hit anything. Look at this Hammerstone quickly grabbing a hold of Diener. Oh, look at this raw strength. Oh! Quite the shot. Well, like I was saying, Jake, I mean, there was a lot of expectations put in front of you. I mean, I'm sure that affects the expectations you have for yourself, right? I always have high expectations for myself, and then it was all ripped away from me every single time I stepped foot there. Well, That's what it is. Well, I mean, there were, you did have a uh -oh. lot of incredible opportunities. Uh -oh, look uh -oh. out. Let's go for a choke bomb. The hammer's still Come on. taking a swipe at Cody Diener. Diener's going for the stunner. Oh! 
Oh, he got stunned there by Hammerstone. Oh, my lord. See, pandering, nonstop pandering. And then he met Hammer. Let's take one more look at this. Bam, right on the button there by Hammerstone. Hey, Gad. Well, I mean, like I said, lots of opportunities for you. Now, how could we forget at Emergence 2023, you took on the IWGP Heavyweight Champion, Sonata. I mean, that was a huge opportunity for you. Bringing up all these things that I had mishaps on, and I don't, you're trying to just make me mad. No, 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 Jake, it, it, clearly a lot has been festering for you over the last few months, and when you went one-on-one -on -one with Eric Young recently on Impact, you finally snapped, you attacked Eric Young from behind. That's what led ultimately to this partnership between you and Hammerstone. I think people are just trying to get to the bottom of your feelings right, on the situation. Exactly. Cover and a kick out. It was a moment of clarity, and I've never felt such clarity before. And now I do. Now I feel it. And now, that's what's going to keep happening. That right there. What is it about Hammerstone that you feel you two have in common? Besides just looking at us and looking yes. like we will dominate everyone get in the ring with, yes. besides the fact that we can beat world champions, besides all that. Beyond that. Beyond that, it's not just a physical strength that we have. We have stronger minds than anyone you know. We have stronger wills than anyone you know. And just the fact that we can get in here and do things just like that, that's, that's what it's all about. That, that's what I'm talking about right there. Cody's not doing that to Hammer. Well, clearly you do have a lot in common with Hammerstone, but I mean, Diener is your blood. And to just abandon him? Blood means nothing to me. You know what means something to me? Gold. Gold means something to me. I'm oh. gonna get oh. and a bell clap there by Diener. A little separation between himself and Hammerstone. And Diener might have a chance. I mean, why couldn't you get gold with Diener, you know? Look at him. What did he do when he came out here? Now Diener whipped into the corner by Hammerstone. On shoulder first into the post goes Hammerstone. Now Diener. Trying to figure out what to do next. He's calling to the people, looking for some guidance. This, this is what it's all about. He was on that bad path, and I think, I think Diener's concerned for you, for, for the path that you're heading down. He doesn't want to see you go down that dark hole that he himself has been in. Well, he should be concerned, but the only thing he should be concerned with is if he gets in my way again. Uh -oh. oh! In front of an atomic drop, it looked like Diener just ticked off Hammerstone there, but Cody's got a window of opportunity here. Oh! oh back to the Bulldog, but Hammerstone too strong. Come on, Diener! Eat him up, eat him up. And now the big monster, Hammerstone, going for a clothesline. Oh, oh going for the stand We got it. If Hammer doesn't, this isn't just for him, okay? This is for me, too. Do you understand that? I'm not in there smacking Cody because Hammer is doing it. He beats Cody. That's me beating Cody. Uh, I see. Oh, so he's calling for the DDT, trying to end this. Ooh. Oh, the back elbow by Hammerstone. Uh, you speak as though Hammer is an extension of yourself. Cody is the reason I have lost a so much. Oh! Face first goes Diener. Is this it? Oh, oh. Diener kicked out. Come on. Listen, the power of the people, I mean, it, it's a powerful thing. And, and he's, Diener has the people behind him. It doesn't matter. You don't even know what power is. So don't talk about it. I, I Hold on. Oh, God. Now, this could be true power. Looking for the nightmare pendulum there. Dean are able to slip down the back. Hammerstone holding on to the ropes. On oh. Hammerstone out of the ring. Oh, now, Dean oh. oh. dive through the ropes. Oh, the Hammerstone's back oh, no. up, but he's got to hold it, Dean. Finish it. Oh, oh. and Hammerstone oh. sent face oh. first into the post. Oh, oh. All right, Cody Diener trying to get Hammerstone back into the ring and runs into Jake something. Now Diener looking to the people for inspiration, going up top. 
and Dana went for the crossbody, but Hammerstone oh, no. able to roll oh, through. No. Oh no! Oh look Dana's at this. in a bad way right now. Raw power from Hammerstone. The oh. pendulum connects. Hammerstone beats Dana. Here's your winner, Hammerstone. Well, it's hard believe some of the things that Jake something said. I mean, he certainly has a point. A hell of a message sent by Jake something and Hammerstone.